Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am super excited about this video today because I am bringing you all a Vova and DHgate haul. Honestly, you guys do not know how excited I am to film this haul because everybody has been asking me to film this video. It probably is my most requested video that everybody asks me to film whenever I ask for video suggestions and I thought it would be the perfect time because I have not filmed a Vova haul in around four months and you know I like to spend a bit more money on on cheap designer items and you guys you love to watch these hauls so it is a win-win really so I have ordered quite a few items both off Vova and DHgate those apps are honestly a lifesaver for myself in my bank account and you guys as well if you don't know what Vova or DHgate is basically they are apps on the app store where you can find so many amazing cheap design items on there the brands such as Chanel, Gucci, Louis Vuitton, Dior, whatever else, even Nike and Adidas as well and any brand you can name it will 100% be on there so if you want to grab yourself a bargain I highly recommend heading over to there after you've watched my video guys because you do not want to miss out on all these amazing items I have picked up because I just am obsessed as I'm probably going to say throughout this video I am actually obsessed with everything but yeah but before we get into this video please make sure to leave a thumbs up it would be nice to get to a like goal of maybe 100 likes because I know that my photo hauls do get a bit more views also leave a comment if you are enjoying the video and also subscribe because I've been wanting to get to 5,000 subscribers we will hit it very soon if you guys subscribe so if you're not subscribed you click the subscribe button and we'll make it happen but without further ado let's go on the video now just before I show you the items you guys are probably really eager to see them if you want any links from Vova unfortunately the links do not work so I will happily send you all a screenshot of whatever item you like on Instagram my Instagram is alice.homes underscore make sure to follow me as well and I will be following more people back on there now because I want to try and grow up my Instagram I think I'm going to show the items from Vova first just because the DHgate items are slightly better compared to the Vova ones so starting off I will probably start off with this beauty I've got this gorgeous baby pink Louis Vuitton Pochette Follicle or Follicle Pochette I'm not quite sure how you say the name but this bag screams Alice vibes like it's pink it's cute it's got a bit of gold on there and it's just absolutely stunning I actually got this off a seller who got me this for free because I basically made an order a few months ago now and the bags you never arrived so as a gift they actually sent me this little bag over the, firstly the colour is absolutely stunning I am obsessed with it it obviously has the monogram print on here in pink and the engravement is actually so deep and really clear to see um, if you've not watched any of my other Vova hauls I did actually get a black one of these and the chain actually snapped on it like I was so sad about it but now I will be able to reuse the black one with this chain as well like the chain is really long but I've kind of just wrapped it around a little bit and that's like the perfect length for me and it also says the Louis Vuitton on the little button in there engraved and then when you open it up it's like a bright pinky colour I don't think the real bag is like as bright pink as this one but it's fine with all of it you know I actually find the name of the seller and like a photo in case you want to buy it maybe it is from the seller VDXX0213 I will put like a screenshot of the seller's name for you guys just in case you want to have a look and like a screenshot of the photo of the bag as well but oh my god it's absolutely stunning I absolutely love the bag so much I'm just gonna and this is £29.5 in case you're wondering and it doesn't it come with a dust bag or a box but it comes packaged really well the only thing I will say is it does have like a bit of like a gluey kind of smell to it but it will air out when you take it out and like outside and stuff and also inside it comes with like a little card holder which is so handy because it it basically is like a purse with like a chain but you can also make it into a handbag and 
it's got a card slot, it's got the four on each side and it also has the Louis Vuitton in the gold in there. The Louis Vuitton is probably one of my favourite designer brands. Why do I say that? They're like so French, I'm like the Louis Vuitton. I definitely think I definitely think it is one of the most popular designer brands out there but their bags are just absolutely unreal and then he also has like a little coin purse and you could put anything in here like your makeup, your money, you could put like the sanitary towels in there if you're a woman, jewellery in here maybe, just whatever you like, it's so handy and I actually took this to Leeds, um, I actually took this handbag to Leeds when I went with Scott and oh my god it is so handy, like you can, you don't even have to bring a purse with you, which is like the plus side of using this handbag because I feel as if when you want to take like a smaller handbag and you can't fit your purse in there, it's actually awful. But with this one, it's perfectly easy to take all your cards and cash with you and it basically is like a purse on a chain, so win-win. But yeah, this is the first item from Vova and I am super impressed as always and I would love to have all these handbags in every colour so if anybody wants to send me more of these handbags hit me up on Instagram you know and we can do a brand deal or whatever <laughs> I wish but you know it's fine yeah I love this bag a lot and it definitely is one of my favourite designer handbags it's so cute next item is I actually have this really cute Dior headband so it's like a Thai headband it's got the navy Dior print on it oh my god I am obsessed with this I think I might have bought this for like around £4. I'm just going to have a look at who I bought it off. I'm enjoyable shopping. So I will put like another screenshot of it obviously. And this actually suits me really well. Because what I find with some headbands is sometimes they cannot suit me that well. But with this I love it. And it's so comfortable to wear as well. And I do actually have a Dior bag as well. Which matches with this. But yeah. I feel as if... Dior is very trendy and I do actually have a couple of these for sale. I will be selling these for around £15 so hit me up on Instagram if you want to buy some. The headband here, I've got the two of the Thai ones here and I've also got the one navy one. So if you want to buy one off me hit me up on Instagram and you can buy one off me. They're really affordable and they will arrive within like a couple of days as well so you might as well buy them off me while I've got them. I've actually sold a few and they are actually sent out really quickly. But this headband was a whopping £5.57, including postage, I think it's pretty good. And it's so comfortable. It'll be perfect for like the summertime to give your hair out your face or any occasion you can wear it for like meals and stuff. I love it. It's really comfortable to wear and it definitely suits everybody's kind of like hair shape and stuff, you know. And it was absolutely bargain. And the Dior is becoming one of my favourite designer brands at the minute as well. So, yeah, I am obsessed with it, honestly. And next up, I actually have a pair of sunglasses, which are Chanel, because Chanel is very classy. These sunglasses are absolutely unbelievable. I've always struggled to find sunglasses which suit my little face. I do have like a very small face but these sunglasses are something else. They look beautiful. They block out the sun. They are so bougie. They did meant to have two pearls on both sides but they wanted them unscrewed themselves so I will have to screw them back in. But they are beautiful. These are like a lovely kind of cream and black colour and they do have these in all sorts of colours. I've got them in black, brown, a red. There's something new to colour which I've got which is my personal favourite. The real Chanel sunglasses are like, uh, how much are they? Probably £200 and these were £6, £6 and one pence. So I don't know why it had to be £6 and one pence but that one pence could probably go towards postage, I don't know. But yeah, you've got them in black, red, brown, beige and a leopard print but the beige are definitely more Chanel kind of classy vibes and these were from the seller HFT JSA. Now some of these shop names are really random but it's fine and oh my god they, these are so comfortable and I've actually had a lot of compliments on them. So you have quite a small face and you want some sunglasses which suit you. Get these ones because they're so good and really good quality as well. 
and here they also they have Chanel engraved in the left hand corner on there which I think is is really cool and they're very sturdy and I've wore these loads and this is still in excellent condition and they also have the Chanel sign on the end on there which I think is really cute but for £6 for like a cheap pair of sunglasses is really good because the quality is actually insane so I'm super impressed with these thank you for for, for providing me with these actually beauties actually stunning final item from Fova I have is some Chanel socks like I've become obsessed with Chanel as well guys but oh my god these socks are so like bougie and so like the classic Chanel vibes and I've actually ordered quite a few pairs of socks from Vova and they're actually better than Primark quality so that is saying something that if Primark quality are worse than Vova quality then yeah like obviously Vova, obviously like a lot of Vova items it must be good quality to beat Primark that's all I'm saying but anyway I decided to buy the Chanel socks because I've obviously tried quite a few pairs of socks off Vova and I knew that these would be no exception Ex exception exception no exception I don't know but I knew that it would be amazing quality and a good size and my feet are like a size 4 so that's why I think I might have got them in like a, like a, in like a size 37 a euro 37 I think I'm not quite sure but it's absolutely stunning and it had them in all sorts of colours but I wanted to go but I wanted to go for like a classic kind of like a nude kind of creamy whitey colour and these were actually 9.63 so like a bit more expensive for one pair of socks especially but you could definitely tell the quality and the gold Chanel writing and logo on there is uh, the quality yeah it's just unbelievable and I know that yeah, they're definitely not they come off they have them in black brick red ivory which is what I've got I think ivory yeah ginger which is like a mustard colour and then hair's blue which is actually really nice I like the hair's blue colour actually and these were from the seller Z Hang Ling Yum if you want me to send a screenshot of that like the seller's name on Instagram feel free to message me because it like it is quite hard to pronounce but these socks are actually unreal quality I know that they will be really comfortable. I'm actually going to take them off the thing now just to try and, and see what they're like. Oh, but they're still attached. Wait a minute. Let's have a look. Let's, let's have a look at what these are like because, you know. Oh, they're really nice. They need to look really nice with traders. Oh my god. I love the logo on them. Like, it's actually amazing. They're really nice, really pretty. And if I like these, I will, like, update you all on what I feel about them but I will definitely be ordering more even though they're nine pounds a pair I definitely know that they will be good quality I can already tell and the Chanel is like a lovely brand and it's it, it's very classy as well so hopefully people will compliment me on my little socks moving on to DHK I am the, so excited because I feel as if DHK is actually slightly better than Vova because you can always find you can always find better quality duplicates on there and it's actually easy to find the cheap designer items on there hence why I did spend a bit more but it was so worth it so firstly I am just going to show you this I don't even have to explain like the box itself is just a wow okay so that is I decided to pick something up from Dior because he's becoming one of my favourite designer brands. I feel as if my three favourite designer brands now is Louis Vuitton, Dior and Chanel. But oh my god, Dior, their packaging, I love it. I actually am obsessed with these. If you guess this down below of what you think is in this box, you probably already know because like, it, looks a bit, it looks a bit like a certain type of box to put something in. Are you ready? So... I'm just going to open the lid. The packaging is absolutely beautiful. It has Dior and goals on there. I you open it up. It's got like a proof of payment in here. And then a little dust bag. It even says Dior 
on the dust bag. The dust bag is like a bit like a bit cheap. The book we roll of it. Are you ready to see what is inside here? Yeah, some people are gonna love these and some people are gonna hate them, but I love these. Are you ready? I have got a pair of these absolutely stunning Dior mules. They are baby pink, they are everything I have ever wanted and more in a in a sandal. Like ever since ever since Dior brought these out I it was just admiring them and when I found out that DHgate had them on their website I immediately had to make a big order and order them. They are, oh, where do I start? I mean yeah, let's just take a moment because they're actually stunning. So I think I must have ordered these probably like a little while ago now and I've kind of been I've kind of been holding them back for the haul obviously because I didn't just want to make like one haul if you know what I mean. But I'm just going to try and find what I ordered. So these were £32.26, pence, which I think is really good because yeah, the real Dior meals are probably like, I don't even know, probably like £400, £500. And Dior is quite an expensive designer brand as well. But they yeah. just say the Christian Dior Paris on there. And I got these in size 4 and they had these in, in every colour you could think of. But I decided I was going to go for the classic kind of like the navy blue and the white but then I found these and was like no chance I'm gonna go for the navy blue when I've got them in baby pink so yeah so let's take Christian Dior Paris on there and they have like Dior on the bottom and, and the shoe size and then Christian Dior Paris in like in the insole bit or if you call it I don't really know and they do have like a slight wedge as well and I have tried to walk in these and they are quite slippery but it'll probably be good to wear for like when it's not scorching hot because the feet you kind of will slip out of them but these are from the seller sneaker underscore shoes 2020 but when i click on the item it says product not found so i don't know if you don't sell them anymore but i made sure to have a look around and i am pretty sure other sellers are going to be selling these because they're too pretty I love them so much and the box is really good quality as well and of course I'm going to keep the box on top of my wardrobe of like all my other designer boxes I think for £32 it's a pretty good deal and I'll be able to wear these with like shorts dresses probably even jeans if I wanted to and I do have a very narrow feet and these are probably made more for like slightly wider feet but I'll be able to wear them I could even wear them as slippers if I really want to you know like if I really want to be that bougie but I don't think I will but yeah the eyes are beautiful and the quality of these is, is insane again and you definitely get what you pay for if you pay slightly more on these type of apps you will definitely get better quality and it just shows like yeah it just yeah final item which I have to show you is, is something which I've always wanted ever since I was like even a kid probably it is from a certain brand honestly I am speechless when I found this duplicate I had to just order it and there wasn't actually any photo reviews on this item by the way so I was pretty scared when it arrived because I was like oh my god imagine if this is not the same kind of size or it looks completely different to the photo type of thing but no are you ready this is something which if I ever got the chance to go to Louis Vuitton and choose any handbag I would choose this one but I've got it now so you ready it is the speedy handbag the speedy 30 it was a strap by the way in case you're wondering I am um, in love this handbag is just it's the thing i've been i've been waiting for for all this time it's finally arrived today that's why i want to film this haul as soon as possible because i can't wait to use it and i don't you want to ruin it before i film this haul so basically i found this gorgeous handbag on dhgate i think i might have 
I think it was around £52 and you had this in the monogram, this Damia print and also what other one did they have? They're kind of like white and grey Damia print but personally for me this one is my favourite and it, it even comes with like a little lock you to lock the handbag with and also a set of keys as well which I think is actually unbelievable because the real speedy the real speedy handbag it does actually come with like a lock and some keys so it's really good for like if if anyone did get hold of your handbag and wanted to get in it they won't be able to because you'd have the keys on you which I think is really good but yeah this handbag is absolutely stunning the Demi print it's my favourite from Louis Vuitton I'm just trying to find who I got it from I got it from Ojin Unscore Wholesale I will put like another screenshot obviously and I will put like a photo of the item as well and this has the 5 star reviews and it ha no this has got the 599 reviews and it's got the 5 stars and all of them so yeah, that's why I ordered it it has a Louis Vuitton engraved on the strap on there on the side it's got it engraved like on the padlock as well which I think is really cool and it even says like 30 engraved as well yeah, because you can, get, you can get like different sizes you can get the 25 for the 30 or the 35 but the 25 it probably would have been a bit too small and the 35 would probably be and then 35 would have probably been a bit too big so yeah, that is why I went for the 30 and this handbag was this handbag was £59 so a pretty good price and I'm definitely going to look after this and this will probably be, and this will probably be one of my favourite items because it's a, a gorgeous I cannot exp express how much I love it um, and it, it used to be like my shopping bag I'll be able to take it into town with me and go shopping. The quality is insane. It does have like a tiny bit of smell of like glue, but it's not that bad compared to you know, this handbag here because this one actually reeks. Like it's still really strong now, and I've had it for like a week, so yeah. But if you want to grab yourself an excellent dupe of the Speedy handbag, give me a message. I'll give you all the details about it and you can order one off the seller because it actually arrived within two weeks as well which is really good oh yeah I forgot to mention yeah, pretty much all these items arrive within like a week they probably even I think these the socks actually arrived in six days which is actually really good because like they obviously do come from China most of the items yeah, this handbag took two weeks to arrive I think everything else took around a week and a half so just before your order just be aware that the items won't arrive within like three to four working days it will take like a bit longer because it will be coming from overseas but it's worth the wait like honestly but anyway here is the end of my fourth Andy H Gate haul comment down below what your favourite sign item from this video was because for me personally it's got to be this beauty here she is beautiful what we want to call her because I think that we should call her comment down below the name of this little bag because yeah she deserves to have a name she's going to be well looked after guys but anyway I really hope that you guys have enjoyed this video if you have then make sure to leave a thumbs up a comment down below and also subscribe and if you want to message me about anything just give me a message on my Instagram I'll put it on the screen again and if you want me to film any other type of hauls just leave a comment of what hauls you'd like to see and yeah i will see you all in my next video